All right, guys, Ray Dog, Sam and Sutherland. Uh, I have the Otter Creek, the CGS, Nomad LT, and the Magnus in a CB version. Um, nine inches, nine and a half, eight and a half, and nine inches. Uh, let's just throw these on the scale real quick. Basically 17 for the Otter Creek. And that's with a direct thread insert in it. We're at 15 for the CGS with a direct thread. Um, that's the shortest can of the bunch. And 12 and a half. I don't think that has a normal rating though. And the Magnus. Um, that's the CB version. It doesn't have anything in it. 14.7. I'm going to use a uh, flash hider just so I can throw it on the so 17.8, 17.9 with the flash hider. Uh, we're going to throw this on the 23 inch Ruger. We're going to start, there you go, with the Outer Creek. So we're going to use the trusty old Ruger you guys have seen before. It's like a 23 inch barrel. Um, there we go. So get on there. Yeah, just leave that loose. It's easy. And then you just pull it back and line it up every time. There you go. See, touch it just like that. So Sam's learning and been coming and doing some testing with us every now and then. Instead of staying at the office and answering phones and talking to dealers, we, we pull him out. He shoots precision rifle and runs matches up here in Wyoming. It's, uh, he's a really good fit for us. So, uh, there you go. Again, we got Turbo here running the pulse. I just want you guys to see I got my cheaters this time. Yep. First shot, mil spec 131.3. You ready? And you guys can see that, right? If it worked like this. What was that last one? 130.6. You can see how he lines it up to make sure that the muzzle is right and long. With the mics. 131.4. 131.4. Just the last one? Yep. That is number five. After shot show what was that last number 131.4 again yep so after shot show we are going to do some educational videos um i have spoke to some of the other manufacturers out there that own pulses we are going to get together um and then part of the game is always getting hot cans off and putting new ones on and yeah things get hot slipping try that uh wrench on the, there you go. Just break it quick, pa pow There you go. Stuff gets hot, baby. But we just like to run unedited iPhone videos because it's simple. Pretty simple. What's next, CGS? Yep. So the CGS is a nice can. This is a, this is the printed one, right? Yeah, so this is one of the printed CGS cans. Josh and Mike over there making good shit. Mr. West and crew. There it is, so you can see it. 
That's the printed one. All right. So the hog saddle is nice because you can kind of slide and get it back. Yeah, touch the, use the bottom of the can to touch the white tape. There you go, right in line. Takes a little practice, but uh, he's getting used to it. He's learning. Pull it back a little, see how you're over the string? Pull it back and use the front of the can to touch the string. There you go. Hard day's work, huh, Sam? <laughs> I think Sam likes when we steal them from there the front are. office and say, hey, come to the range with us. All right, so CGS. You can see the whole waveform there. One twenty eight seven. Ready. And again, like we explained on the video, one thirty. We uh. Ready. We're really looking at that area in the yellow because that's. Air. Was that five already? Five shots. That was pretty quick. Right? Five. Try to get it off of there. Again, the ammo is LR118. That's for another video. That's the Fly 9. Sick. Look, a quick tease in the middle of this video while he's working. In the long configuration with a booster on it. Ooh, 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 baby. Look at that thing. You can see the modular part right there. So the short configuration only goes from here to here and it's like five ounces. Again, look. Pretty slick, but that's another video. What's up now? So the LT. The Nomad LT. This is an impressive can because this is the quietest 30 cal can we have needed until we made that uh, Magnus. And the impressive part is it, you know, it's shorter and lighter than the other stuff. Back, Back a little. Perfect. See, what I do is I use the front of the can. I come and I hit this. Yeah, and then you know you come right up and you're good, you know? Makes it consistent. All right, so now Nomad LT. Ready. Show you the numbers and you guys who are smart could look in, like I said, you could see the sonic crack there and you can see what's going on after in that little time window we have. 130.3. Ready. Seven, eight. Ready. We will be doing some Norma testing. I don't think I can shoot this one on the Norma. I'm not sure. I'll ask Todd. It, it's pretty Ready. light and I don't want to destroy it. One twenty seven nine. All right, so that's Five on that. The LT, that's five. And you can see how it also shows us time out and what happens. Here's the peak column here. So 
Ta-da! All right, take that off. And I know no Bella in this video. I uh, I put her outside for a little while. She's got a coat on and she sits down and chews on her ball in the snow and has a good time. And this is, again, the new Magnus. We're using a flash hider as a direct thread insert so that we can shoot all the um, cans on the same hose with a 5 8 by 24 thread. This video is almost over, last five shots, for 10, 11 minutes already. All right, Sam's learning, it's good. Ready when you are. Like I said, you tech guys, you can look at this all you want, you can see what's going on. Ready? First shot, 125. Ready? See that? 125. 126.1. That negative first round pop. Ready? Twenty-three, four. Pretty impressive. Ready. Nine-inch can. And these numbers again are mil spec. This is not a uh, shooter's ear. One twenty-five, eight. Is that three or four already? Ready. Awesome. Number five right Pull now. it back. Pull it back. There you go. Yep. See how in line. What was that one, Terps? One twenty-five, one. One twenty-five, one. You like that, kid? I love it. That was five? five. All right, so uh, that is the new Magnus. Again, this will be the first can coming with uh, the hub or the universal. Though it was a 1375 by 24 threads in the rear. So you guys out there with chemos or ASRs or whatever else out there, you can run whatever you want. Um, the 300 normal guys, we've been getting asked for this. I've actually had some unit asking about something like this a little smaller than the 338 but bigger and more suppression than the nine for the 300 norma so now we got it what you think sam i love it this can right. be awesome let's see what else we could get done here today because shot show is only a couple weeks away